Hello and welcome to Indus News. Coming to you from our studios in Lahore, I'm Joseph Hyatt and these are the top stories. Saudi Arabia's King Salman bin Abdulaziz has assured Afghanistan of the kingdom's support for the peace process. In a phone call, President Ashraf Ghani appreciated Saudi Arabia's role. Ghani said forthcoming peace talks in Jeddah are a good step forward. Pakistan has played a pivotal role in organizing Afghanistan's peace process. Moving on, Yemen's government and rebels have agreed to open the road linking the capital Sana with Hodeida port. Houthi rebel negotiator Hamid Assam said 12 ships would be allowed to bring humanitarian aid into Hodeida. Yemeni rebels have started to redeploy forces inside the port city under a UN-sponsored truce. Meanwhile, four more Kashmiri freedom fighters have been martyred by Indian occupation forces. They were martyred in a gunfight in southern Palwama district of occupied Kashmir. Another freedom fighter was martyred there on Friday. Next, authorities in Bangladesh have deployed around 600,000 security personnel ahead of Sunday's general elections. This follows a violent campaign in which 10 political activists were killed. More than 1,100 political activists were injured in campaign clashes. And following a deadly attack on foreign tourists, Egyptian security forces have killed 40 terrorists. The Interior Ministry said security forces carried out raids on the three terrorist hideouts in Giza and Sinai. Three Vietnamese tourists and a guide were killed in a roadside bombing near the Giza pyramids on Friday.